Live from Omaha, Nebraska, the 40th NCAA Volleyball Championship match. The Kentucky Wildcats, their first ever national championship appearance. The opponent, the Texas Longhorns, looking for the third championship in their storied history. One of the best all-around players in the country. Both teams with good early block touches. Settle in. If you like Rafa Nadal and Roger Federer, that's how <laughs> long it's going to take. Is it hard to score or what? That could have been a double contact. The Texas coaches are irate. Raya Walker, defensive specialist, had a couple of aces in their semifinal win over Washington. What a good block. Brian Butler on the slide, and Stumler was there to stop it. I'll tell you, that's a nice move. One on one opportunity for Stumler. Dives into that angle on Butler. For Texas leading it 17 14. Skinner again. Brian Butler right in her face. Ball set too tight, a rare mistake by Gabriel in transition. Oh, that's so good. Stumbler again. Seventh, excuse me, sixth kill on eight swings. Well, Kentucky doing a nice job being patient. We talked about this early. A lot of transition plays, smart with their swings when they're off the net. And she knows she has that inside hand to Butler right now. She's been able to score on it. Butler needs to drop that inside hand and not let her hit that sharp angle. Very unusual for Kentucky on 28 swings, already seven errors. On the slide, tucked down inside, and Teeler was late. Teeler trying to defend the middle was late there, and now Texas with a 21-16 advantage. Set point number two for the fourth-seeded Longhorns. Fields again. Just a sophomore, the amount of time she takes in the air, and Texas takes the opening set. Oh, that's for sure, playing better and better as this match is progressing. One on one on the slide, and what a roof. Well, maybe that's why they leave going one on one with the slide. <laughs> Excellent left side blockers dropping into the angle. Look at this move by Avery Skinnell. You'll see on to serve, working on Stumbler. High flat, can Curry run it down? She does. A couple of spectacular plays by Gabby Curry, but then Brian Butler saying, not this time. Holy moly. Gabby Curry goes, makes this huge play. That's enough. And then she comes back in and huge dig off of Brian Butler. Unbelievable defense on the Kentucky side. Well, they're making their way back, hitting 444 right now in this set. This is normal Kentucky offense that we're used to seeing. Good block out of the middle. Azani Teeler with the read. How big is that? It was huge, but that's the move. It's a dive into an angle. She's waiting for it, sees it, and then dives into that angle. Served by Ali Stumler. Stumler closes it out. She's already got a dozen kills, four digs, and that was her second service ace. And what a bounce back for the Kentucky Wildcats. Dropping the first set, they win the second 25 18. And now for the national championship, we're playing two out of three. Well, Craig Skinner, the Kentucky coach, told me before this set tonight that they have got to play consistent volleyball. He said, we can't have five good points and let our guard down. They'll have to come back even stronger here in set three. Contact by Lily first. Stumler going off speed. 
Stumler's had a really big match so far, and I think a long way to go, as so has Skyler Fields. Fields now with 10 kills on 20 swings, and on the other side, Ali Stumler, 12 on 26. Very low error rate, Salima. Stumler now with 14 kills. Eggleston trying to come right back. Nice play defensively once again by Lilly. O'Neal, what a play by Curry after the block touch. Tied at seven. <laughs> Stumbler again over the top. What a rally, but can you believe that stab by Gabby Curry? She's in the left back. Are you kidding me right now? I don't know how she made that play. Change directions and the finish by Stumler. Playing unbelievable defense right now, digging everything. Free ball for the Wildcats. Rip down the line. Maddie Skinner with a kill. Kentucky back on top. Right now, who's playing well? Who's feeling it? She just streaks him for a while. Maddie Skinner, two of six in the opening set. In the second set and on since then, 10 of 13. Oh, what a block. I mean, that is what a setter wants to do. But look how big Madison Lilly plays above the net. Huge drop on Skyler Fields. High flat shot once again by Maddie Skinner. And Kentucky dropped the opening set 25-20. But since then, they have won two straight. They win the third 25-23. One more set, and they'll have their first national championship. Phillips is really doing a good job blocking on the outside. You'll see all over that transition opportunity. Eggleston hammering into the cross court. Very quick start and bounce back for Texas, leading 5 1. Good block by Stumler and right back to you. Allie Stumler, perfect example of playing both ends. Well, that's exactly what she does well. And this ball, you'll see Asia O'Neill gets stuck a little bit hitting that slide. Tries to get back here in the middle, late to close. Pretty easy serve by Gabriel, but barely kept off the floor. Texas looking for the tie. Fields is skying for kills. Skyler Fields just going up over the top, but look at that beautifully executed set by Gabriel. She's in a balanced position. It's hard to read where she's going to go. You just have to wait and see where it goes. Into the block. Stuffed on Breon Butler. Texas now trailing 21-19 in a must-win situation. Timeout called by Texas. Kentucky four points away from their first ever national title. O'Brien has been error prone from the service line. Good one there. Oh, a break for Texas. Logan Eggleston just skying on a set that was too tight. Through the hands, an ace serve. Nalani Yosia, the freshman out of Torrance, has been rock solid in the backcourt. Stumler out of system for the championship. Allie Stumbler leads Kentucky to their first ever title, having the career match of her life. How, how apropos for Allie Stumbler to put that ball away. Out of system, good serve. She takes a tough swing against one of the biggest and best blocking teams in the country and just annihilates it into the cross court for her 26th kill and the first national championship for Kentucky. Well,